Yo, what up everybody, it's your boy Mr. Ghana Baby right here and today is my birthday and this is how I want to celebrate it. Good morning to each and everyone out there. It's your boy Mr. Ghana Baby here in Eswantini, Swaziland. I'm going to do something today that I've never ever done, which means this video is not part of Africa to the world. This is a personal story. Like I said, I grew up in the village, that's what I call myself, the village boy. I started wearing shoes and I met this beautiful Zimbabwe woman in South Africa and she asked me... Where is your slippers? So I had to go back for my slippers, throw away the shoes, so this legendary slippers is back again. You know what we're going to do today? Let me tell you something that I, I think most of you didn't know. I grew up in a small village. And um, at some point in time, my father couldn't keep up with our school fees. My father couldn't keep up with the uniform that we wear to school. So basically, I go to school with a torn uniform. You know, like you see my ass in my school uniform. It comes to a point in time that you go to school without a bag, without a shoe. It came to a point that you go to school with just one food. You know, my mom used to sell kenke. So in the morning, I eat kenke before I go to school. In my canteen, my mother would put kenke. When I go to school, I have no option than to swap the kenke with someone else whose mother can only afford watch it. That's another food in Ghana. So I decided to bring this episode, go to rural areas in every African country that I go to. I mean, places that looks like where I came from. I'll go to the school, go pick one kid who is smart, but the parents can't afford, just like me. I remember that it's a day in school I won an award they told me that they're going to give me the award in, um, how do you call it, um, at the assembly hall. First of all, I came to school late. Immediately, I went in front. They mentioned my name to go for the award. I mean, like I said, you can see my ass. Everybody started laughing at me. They didn't even give me the award. They brought the award to me in my classroom. This happened to me in secondary West Street. If you are from West Street, and I mean, if you are my classmate, you definitely know what I'm talking about. It's raining, but I was still from this video. So I'm here. No, I mean, I cannot do this video alone. Where, where are my brothers? Hey, come on, it's raining. It's okay. We still have to film. What's the name of this school? Come closer. Uh, it's, um, this is Lutz Lutz Primary School. A primary school? Yeah, I actually did my primary year from 2002 to 2007. In this school? Yeah. Exactly. So what's the name of the school? It's Lutze Lutze Primary School. Lutze Lutze Primary School. Lutze Lutze. Yeah. I just call it Long Long because Lutze, like Bootze, it's the, the land of something. Okay. Yeah. You know what? Mm -hmm. I want you to help me, I mean, find a smartest kid, but coming from maybe a poor background. Yeah, yeah. Um, we have to go. Is there anything that we have to do? No, we just have to start from the office. Okay. Like, get permission from the parent, I, I mean from the head teacher. Okay. And then they can sort of vet and find the best student to, to, to suit your criteria. Okay. Thank you so much. And um, this is the gentleman himself. <laughs> I'm going to do a video about him before I leave. No, I'm not going to tell you right now. I'm, I mean, you're going to see that video. Morning. How are you? Good. Thank you. How are you? I'm good. Hi. You. I'm good. Yeah, we, we are with this gentleman. Uh, they are from Ghana. Mm -hmm. uh, they are in Switzerland doing stuff, uh, showing the world to Africa. Uh, sorry, they are showing Africa to the world. Uh, mm -hmm. So in their cause, they wanna they wanna help a, a kid who's not that um, who's the last child Yes, yes. So they wanna help with the uniform. They wanna help at home with some food parcels. So we'd like you to to sort of like the vet and get us uh, a kid who, who suits their specification who is smart, who does well in class uh, yeah. yeah basically uh, the kid has to like the kid is smart yeah and um but comes from a poor, poor background poor. thank you i think that would be very easy to identify because we have a number of such children oh, wow. 
Do you want me to take you to the classroom or you want? I would love to, to take me there oh. and then maybe we go and see okay. the council. So. Shall we go, gentlemen? Thank, thank you. you. Thank you. Actually, I'm taking you to grade 4B. Okay. There is a kid that uh, we have identified there. Okay. The teachers have helped me to identify this child. Okay. I think he fits the description that you wanted. Amazing. A child who's very intelligent, mm. but comes from a very poor background. Good morning, Great Bobby. Good morning, sister. How are you this morning? We are fine, teacher. How are you? I'm good. Please be seated. Yay. Okay, we go. One more time. Good. Yeah. Hey guys, you know what? Uh, we found a kid, so now we are heading to the market to go buy the school uniform. Um, you know, like for now, I can only do for one kid, but in future, I would love to do more than what I'm doing today. And uh, like I said, if you are out there and you have a similar story, definitely this video should let you know that it's time to give back. You know, you don't have to let people pass through exactly the same thing that you pass through this is why i'm doing this like i really didn't want to put this on camera but as a content creator as someone who want to inspire so many people to do this in the various places that they find themselves i had to put this on camera so yeah don't judge me for doing this like i said i'm just a village boy and i had to come to the village to do this my brother where are we going now which market are we going hey you are eating without inviting me Look at you, man! Look at this guy! Okay, you, are, um, you, you, are, you are in... Hey! <laughs> what are you eating? What? These are fat cakes. Fat cakes? Yeah, and this is what you call them, Emma Fate. Emma Fate, when I eat, yep. I'll get fat? Uh, no, maybe, definitely, but look, it's oil. No, but this is like, you know, in Ghana, we call this bath loaf. Ah, Use okay. oil. Okay. Hmm, exactly the same thing. We have this in Ghana, it's called bath loaf. Mm, that's nice. Ghanaians call it both roads. Both roads, yeah. <laughs> finally in the clothing store and uh, we are about to get a uniform you know he knows this place so he has to be in front of us and show us the place the other guy is busy talking to his girlfriend yeah he's not single you know <laughs> Fix this syllabus for me, bro. <laughs> I told you, you just need to stick uh, this thing. I want to use super, super glue. glue. <laughs> no, it's super glue. It's yeah. gonna be torn again. Yeah. Just need to, yeah. So this is the house of the boy, right? Yeah. We finally got to know his house. So we got everything. We got the school uniform. We got um, stationaries. We also went to the uh, supermarket to go get some groceries you bought rice and the rest just to give to the family you cannot just um take care of the boy without taking care of the family so i think we need to go look for the boy and then hand everything then we go back home i'm super hungry bro exactly I I you're also hungry <laughs> 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 the whole day man <laughs> so this is the grandma finally found this is grandma. Sa saubona saubona <laughs> <laughs> so we went to yeah. She speaks English, right? Uh, you understand Swati. English. You speak Swati. Swati. I, I, I will Swati. speak to Swati today. <laughs> no worry, I will speak to Swati today. The language. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Okay. okay, so um, we went to the school, met the teacher and everything just to um, give us the smartest kid in the classroom who has a poor background. Uh, and then they told wow. us that this boy, I mean the son, is the smartest kid with a poor background. That's why we decided to go get everything and then come back in here. So mm. we're here to present the school uniform and also something small for the family. So put it out in general, but this is the school one. But for now, see if we can find a local place. It's from where 
apa tu kan zaga lagu si ngasekaya aksi golong gana ni lu kon. So sesi lagi gem folela timbas atak he, gem folela negu pala ima penseli, segu si negu si kubek kuala fura agle eksen sa fula neti shana letingan. Ah, she says thank you. Ah, uh, no thank you. I just want to tell her that I have been there before, you know, and there's a time that we don't even have like one complete year, no lights in our house. We go to school, we don't even have food to eat and all that. So it's not about thank you, it's something that I love, I, I, I want to do, you know what I mean? Yeah. Definitely. So, Utsu uh, Ungabonganga Nani, Nay, Ugusuga, Exeni, Ukuling Island, Ekai, Vatibala Lagumiam, Baby Tena Labaka, Exeni, Consistence of Scolani, Imbilo Layati, Le, Magabona Lumunvana, Aglesi, Yatsinza Nana. She's very grateful that you are touched and you actually help. Thank you. Come and hold my hand now. You don't understand English? Yeah? <laughs> you don't understand? <laughs> you, don't, you don't speak English, bro? What's your name? Oh, okay. Isha, yeah? <laughs> the name is Mba. Mba. Your name again? What's your name again? Moses. Blessing. Blessing. Ah, blessing. Uh, blessing. Uh, this is for you. Then just take off your song and uh, steady hard, okay? Alright. And um, Grandma, I, I have something for you. Where's mine? Is it, is it locked? Yeah, yeah it open. It's open already? This is for... Uh, Grandma, this one is for you, not for him, yeah? <laughs> <laughs> and then everything is new, just uh, enjoy and make sure you steady so hard and everyone will be proud of you, okay? First of all, I will say that on behalf of this family, I want to say thank you so much for you know taking me around to go find him and also come do this without you guys i don't think this would be possible mm, you're welcome. thank you're you welcome my god you're welcome <laughs> <Mr. Ghana>, baby <laughs> <laughs> and secondly i want to um thank you guys so much for watching this episode like i said i didn't really want to show this on camera but as a content creator I just have to do this to encourage you if you are out there if you have something to offer if you have something to change lives do it i mean this used to be me and um, i mean this used to be me those days and i don't want to see any young african suffering that way so i'll do my best like i said this is the first episode i'm gonna try and do this in every country that i go to so i finish all the african countries so if you're out there and you want to do the same you can reach me out and let's see how we can join hands and do more of this change more lives not just one person but i mean we can even do 10 20 100 because i believe in all of you so boy mr ghana baby so much of the talking and i'm gonna see you in the next one i am my uh, enjoy bye sure. oh, <laughs>